Hello, this is Sam Wickman, and this is the video review for Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Deluxe Class Soundwave. Here is Soundwave in his, um, says on the box his uh, jet mode, but I think this is his satellite mode. Anyway, here's the packaging. These preview figures are available now in the UK. So, um, I think they're available at the minute in France, Canada, and the UK. But, but very nice picture of Soundwave there. Soundwave, Decepticon, Decepticon symbol, three in one. Um, Decepticon, Transformers: Revenge of the Fallen, five plus, level three conversion. And on the back, Transformers.com, Decepticon symbol, Soundwave, Decepticon, and that says here. Uh, from orbit, Soundwave taps into satellites to bring the human systems under his control. That's what it says there, and then it's got it all in different languages. And then here, Soundwave, 3 in 1 again. There's his um, satellite mode. There's his um, space cruiser mode thing. And it says launching projectile. This is um, Ravage. Yep, and then we can take a quick little look at the instructions. Just take a quick take a quick little look at the instructions. And as you can see, there it's satellite mode. Now, if I'm honest, I think that's the satellite mode, and that's the space shuttle. And then on the back. It tells you how to fire the missile. But yeah, very nice. Anyway, on to the figure. Here he is in his satellite mode. It's very nice. Uh, you can have it really floating however you want, kind of like this. This is the official satellite mode. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of like a Y triangular looking thing that looks like it can rotate in space. And yeah, anyway, you just press this little trigger here, and Ravage will shoot out. And I imagine that's the effect that we're going to have in the movie that Samov will shoot out Ravage. Um, um, just look at that missile there. It's called the Ravage Projectile um, Missile, so that just slots in there. But yeah, there's satellite mode, very nice. Now to transform it, I just need to sit down and pop down the camera. Well, first of all, he is a triple changer, and I don't recall Soundwave being a triple changer before, so this will be kind of nice. But anyway, there's satellite. Transform him to uh, jet mode. You just want to um, lift these like claw pieces up to the side like so. Same on this side. You just want to then. As you can see, some people have missed this, there's a little hole there, and a tab there. For satellite, that tab goes into there, and people have missed that out, so you just want to untab that. Same on this side. And then bring these pieces, panels down. So, twist to the side, twist to the side, and he's virtually done. All you want to do is just take this and pop it down like so. Take it, bring it down and pop it down. And there you have... Oops, sorry. There you have Soundwave in his um, jet mode. Very nice. Um, can still shoot the missile. 
so yeah very good just a quick little look at the jet mode underneath and there's the jet mode now for robot mode you want to let's just get the camera set back up here and get the sound wave here and you just want to press that button and shoot out the missile just take that out then you want to lift these up just lift these back pieces up like so then you want to lift these panels out the way um, then you want to split this here bring each side out and down and they will become the legs sound wave and this panel you just want to push up and in there and you just want to fold these feet out like so and there you can see the legs then what you want to do is you want to untap these arms just from in there rotate those out bring the claws down to the side of the arm um, like so then you want to kind of bring this section all the way down some on the side and the section all the way down now most people think that this is his chest but the actual gimmick here is to lift this up and then fold back and that's his proper chest with those sonic pieces fold this flap down and just bring up the head then you want to just you can really arrange these panels however you want on his back but i just kind of like to leave them facing to form like a cape sort of thing um, and then these just fold over like so and become shoulder armor um, and then the missile you can put in the top here like so and there you have Transformers Revenge of the Fallen oh sorry about that Transformers Revenge of the Fallen deluxe class sandwich in robot mode very nice represents G1 quite a bit you can see the colors have completely changed it's got a lot of gray it's still got the blue and I like all this light blue color um, and everything face sculpt very nice Trying. I can't get this thing to focus, but um, yeah, there he is. You can still fire the missile, but you have to tip him over like so. So, anyway, this has been my review of Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Deluxe Class. Sound wave.